What's up guys? Welcome back to my channel. I know it's been a while. I'm sorry. Um, but I wanted to make this video real quick before I go to bed. Um, I'm sorry for this weird mood lighting, but I don't want to set up my whole thing right now. You girl is tired. I went to Sephora this year. Um, I know their last year was their first year. Um, and I really wanted to go this year. So... <laughs> Uh, my fiance let me splurge Technically he paid for it for me. Um, he was like dude just do the VIP. It's your first time going Just see how it is get the VIP plus you get this Swag bag That is up to it says it's worth $900. So we'll see if that's true when last year was the first year I looked for these videos just out of curiosity so I wanted to make one of these. Um, I don't really have footage from Sephora. Uh, it's a little chaotic there. I have high anxiety so I didn't feel like bringing my camera. Um, I have some pictures I could put in maybe or they might be on my Instagram. So let's jump in real quick. I also want to say you get this thing full of like samples from all the different brands that you go visit. Um, I'll do this first, the swag bag, and then I'll put like a timestamp in for that as well. So I'm just going to start grabbing from here. The first thing in here is Gucci Bloom. It says the hair, hair mist. So it's like some type of hair perfume. I've never owned anything from them. I don't want to open everything right now and smell it because it'll be freaking long. Uh, the next thing is from Lord Jones. I've been wanting to try this from Sephora. It is the High CBD Formula Body Lotion. Um, yeah, I'm a fan of all things CBD. Oh, it's super moody. The next thing in here is from... Uh, the in key list I don't know who that is it just says it's a face serum um, hyaluronic acid I don't know it's a very plain box here Ooh, the next thing is Pat McGrath labs it is fetish eyes mascara And then we have something from Kosha Sport. Um, it looks like it's just his Lip Feel Advanced Lip Care, uh, powered by Active Botanicals. I think it's just fancy chapstick. Um, and then we have It Cosmetics Brow Power Perfector, 5-in-1 Waterproof Powder, Powder Gel Pencil. Marc Jacobs Highliner, a gel eye crayon in black. And then we have, oop, an oldie. I haven't used this in forever. Uh, Urban Decay Eyeshadow Primer Potion, just the original. I haven't used that in forever. And then we've got, ooh, Charlotte Tilbury, Charlotte's Magic Cream. I've never actually tried anything from that brand. So it looks like it's just a moisturizer. Um, the next thing is from Replica. It is, I know these are uh, perfumes. This one says Beach Walk. Sunkissed Salty Skin. I know this lighting is terrible, I'm sorry. And then we've got uh, Beauty, the Beauty Blender Blender Cleanser Solid. Um, I do use the charcoal one in this and I do actually really like it. So this one's just a smaller version. And then we've got Hourglass Veil Mineral Primer Oil Free Sunscreen SPF 15. I used to use this so I know I really like this one. I'm running out of room. The next thing in here is Living Proof. It is their dry shampoo. And then we have some Hum uh, Hair Sweet Hair Gummies. Looks like there's 14 in here. I think usually you have to do 
yeah, you have to take two. So it's only like a week worth. <clears throat> and then we have something from, I never know how to say this brand, Laneige, Laneige, but it is their Lip Glowy Balm in Peach. I really like that brand too. I think there's full <laughs> stuff that I like. <gasps> yes! I have a drunk elephant. Uh, Lala Retro Ripped Whipped Cream. <clears throat> the next is Briogeo Don't Despair Repair Deep Conditioning Mask. And then we have a Dr. Dennis Gross Alpha Beta Pore Perfecting and Refining Serum. We have a, oh, what does it say, tester? That's creepy. Uh, we have something from Amika. I know I like them. It is a dry shampoo. For some reason, this says that it's a tester. Hopefully that's not true, that's creepy. Next in here is a Tom Ford um, perfume. Is that the perfume name right there? I don't know. I normally don't buy Tom Ford. And then we have a Tarte Sea Rainforest of the Sea Hydrating Primer. Is that the second or third primer so far? Next in here is from Yves Saint Laurent. It's a oil and stick. What does that mean? Oh, shine lip color. <laughs> in the shade 12. There's that. This one actually Ellie grabbed straight from the box. I mean, the bag and was like, <gasps> as soon as I came home, she was so excited to see everything. Next we have Too Faced Peach Puff. It is a Long wearing diffused matte lip color in you wish. Uh, next, we have a Huda Beauty Sapphire Obsession Obsessions. I don't normally go for Huda, Be Huda Beauty, except I've been wanting to try blues, but I don't care for blue normally. Now that sounds weird, uh, but yeah, that's pretty cool. Now I can play with blues. Next we have Bite Beauty, their daytime lip balm with Mongongo oil. <laughs> I like Bite Beauty's lip masks. Um, and the last two things in here, we have one from Melt Cosmetics, Stupid Love Lipstick. And then we have Sunday Riley A Plus High Dose Retinoid Serum, which I'll have to give to someone else because and breastfeeding and you can't use retinol, retinol, retinols, retinols. Now we will go through all of these samples. First they had uh, milk makeup. They give you this little bag. It's like one of those like chintzy feeling bags but Ellie loves them. They didn't have any makeup samples. They had a bunch of like pins and cute stuff. Uh, they're at the bottom of the bag. Then Bite Beauty. Gave us these cute little bags too. Charlotte Tilbury. Um, and there's two samples in here. They're both just that uh, magic cream. Um, and then I was at the Diva Curl booth and this girl gave me so many samples. She gave me matcha butter conditioning mask. A little, not even little. It was a really big size. Uh, shampoo and conditioners. Touchable Texture Whip. So it sounds like a mousse, but it's in a packet. And then she gave me an oil. Uh, next, Melt Cosmetics had this little, like, you stick the ball on top and it, like, hits all these little dots and then goes down to the bottom. So I got this lipstick in Shady Lady. Uh, right when you walk in, they have this cute little candy area where you can just fill up a little bag of candies. Oh, you can take a little Polaroid picture at the Melt booth. Lord Jones gave us these little boxes, and this one has the CBD body lotion, the oil, um, 
a gumdrop, but they couldn't do the CBD, Sephora said. And then um, more body lotion little packets in there. There's Youth to People. It's a little toner that they just came out with. Um, and Natasha Denona Single in True Gold. Yves Saint Laurent came out with a new perfume, Libra, I think. I think them and one other one, one other company came out with like a unisex perfume cologne thing. I got five of these little Coca Cabana cream lotions. Um, as a, v a, v a, v as a VIP person, you got this little Sephora water bottle. Um, a Tatcha Silk Peony Melting Eye Cream. This stuff is so freaking soft. Um, they let us put it on our hands, but it's amazing. I can't wait to use it on my eyes. For some reason, they gave me two Natasha Donatas, but they're both in true gold. Um, a Tom Ford, oh, that's the other one. Tom Ford um, Metalique, a new perfume. Lawless, I've never tried them, but they have a setting powder. I feel like it's a good size. Um, pharmacy, they gave me, they gave me a few of these. It's the Green Clean um, Cleansing Balm. That is my favorite uh, makeup remover. And then they also gave us a Very Cherry Bright 15% Clean Vitamin C Serum. I know they have new cherry stuff right now. At Drunk Elephant, they gave us this cute little bag. And then I also got a TLC Frambois Frambus <laughs> Glycolic Night Serum plus their uh, Marula Oil. Um, this new brand called Kosas. Kosas? Kosas? It's weird. It's a tinted face oil. So they gave me a packet. There's like deep tone, medium, and light. Summer Friday, I got. They have like a little spinny wheel thing, and I won this tote. There's stickers, pins, and three different masks in here. NARS was giving out these cute little sparkly envelope things with like a mirror inside. This cute little Sephora mirror. Uh, let's see, this is a Nude Sticks Magnetic, Magnetic, what? Matte lip color in rose. I really like their little mattes. Um, this new Becca stuff, it's their Hydra Mist Set and Refresh Powder. We got some in BoxyCharm and I'm obsessed with this stuff. More hum gummies, more Amika. This is a volume and matte texture spray, which will be good once my hair gets a little longer. Um, fresh sugar strawberry exfoliating face mask. Um, and then you can also go through like a Sephora favorites thing and pay $25. You get this bag and then you get to pick out five items. The five items I picked is the Pharmacy Green Clean, because like I said, I'm obsessed with that stuff. I got an Olaplex um, Hair Perfector. This alone is $28, so that's well worth it. I got an IGK First Class Charcoal Detox Dry Shampoo, Bumble and Bumble Hairdresser Invisible Oil, and then Verb Ghost Dry Oil uh, Disco Edition, because there is glitter in there. But yeah, I didn't want to buy too much because they had like a shopping area, but I had no idea what I was going to get in the uh, swag bag. So I was like, I'm just not going to spend more. But yeah, I definitely enjoyed it. If I had to pick iMats or Sephora, I would actually prefer Sephora. I just like the experience more. They had the cutest little booths and like photo ops. Um, it was a lot more chill vibes compared to... Um, I'm at. And yeah, I hope they continue to do this and I will keep going if they do. Um, that's it. If you'd like to see more from me, subscribe, uh, like the video please, and I will see you next time. Bye! Also, if you saw my makeup and it's a hot mess, I'm sorry. My freaking mascara. Blood. My allergies took away my makeup. <laughs>